Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Nichonomics 101. Um, here is the big teaser slide of what you're going to learn in this particular group of slides, tutorials. First of all, we're going to learn how to niche and improve our customer centricity. And I don't mean to suggest that, that, that any distributors out there might not already be customer centric to some degree. It's just a matter of doing it to a much greater degree and taking really kind of the intuitive art of doing it more or less and making it a very consistent, precise science. Um, as a result of, of, of doing this, we're going to achieve the dream value exchange equation. A bigger concept would be value exchange management, where believe it or not, it's possible to have the absolute highest, best service value proposition and simultaneously the lowest cost to serve. So the super high value proposition brings in the margin dollars. Subtracting the low cost to serve is what gives us high sustainable operating profit because we've created barriers to entry in both how we have created our service value proposition and as well as how we have systematically lowered our cost to serve. Because we are so focused on the right best customers and right best niche for us, the typical upside uh, in, 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 in natural cores surrounded by lots of distracting kinds of business is, a, is an easy double in sales. At the, at the customer level, I've seen accounts where, quote, we're getting the lion's share of the business and sales have gone up 500%. Uh, so, you know, on average, you know, the accounts will go up 20% to 200%. And so sales can go up a lot. Profits will go up even faster uh, because we're tuning service value up, cost to serve down, and we're getting a lot more volume and all those things add to higher sustainable profit before interest and tax. Uh, once we figure out a branch's historic number one most profitable niche, and we'll nail that, and then after that we can go after the number two and so forth, we'll uh, learn how to tune fill rates for based uh, for stock keeping units based on profitability as opposed to just picks uh, for very large gains. We'll learn how to retain, penetrate best accounts. There's a little subset section on cracking target accounts. Uh, and to do that, we need sales reps to be tens, not fives or fours or twos, not reactive firefighting product centric you know, pushing reactive technocrats, but, you know, service value chain tens. Um, and all this will expand the commonwealth capitalism, the, the, the economics for all of our stakeholders. So we're going to be able to attract, keep, and keep engaged the very best stakeholders, whether they be the, the best energy from the best suppliers, the best employees, the best customers, and sort of the best investors if we need them. So that's what we're going to learn. So let's move on to the next slide. Thank you.